Hi everyone, it's Karen from the Geordie Grandma. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're very well on what is a very grey, rainy, cold day in October here in the northeast. So I hope you're all snuggled warm wherever you are. Today I've got an Amazon Essentials try on haul for you um, and I've also got some trainers to show you as well that I've been gifted. Um, so I got six items from Amazon. I used the Prime Try Before You Buy. Um, there was a few things I needed so I thought I'd have a look at a few different things while I was ordering. So as usual I'll show you them first um, tell you how much I paid for them, give you some details about them, then I'll try them on and we can see what they look like. So for information, uh, I'm five foot four. Um, I am a size 18 to 20 and I've got everything today in a 2XL. I do have quite a large stomach. I'm not quite sure what shape I am. I don't think I'm an apple shape. I've just got a big stomach. Um, and I will be wearing shapewear for some of the clothes just to make it look a bit more streamlined. So for the first item, I got a pair of black terry fleece joggers. I got them in, like I say, a 2XL. They do, do come in a size extra small to a 6XL, which all of these clothes do. Um, they are from the Amazon Essentials collection. Uh, they come in 12 different colours. I got them in black. They were £20.50 and they are 60% cotton and 40% polyester. So I'll just show you them. Um, they're just your basic black uh, joggers with the drawstring waist, which I'm not very keen on, but we can work with that. They've got pockets. They're quite wide at the bottom and they feel really, really snuggly. Uh, they've got a nice elasticated waistband, so there is some stretch in there. So I'm going to try those on with the first jumper that I got. And this is a green v-neck uh, long sleeve jumper. Um, I haven't got much green in my wardrobe, so I thought I'd pick a green up. This comes in, also comes in extra small to 6XL. I got it in the 2XL. It comes in 12 colours. It's £21.90 and the material is 55% cotton. 25% modal, whatever that is, and 20% polyester. So I'm going to try this one on with the um, black joggers and we'll see what those look like. Okay, these are both pretty huge on me. I'm just going to step back. I could have definitely sized down. Um, the joggers, they're really comfortable, but they are, I've tied this as tight as I can get it and they are very, very big. Um, I could have definitely sized down. I like the pockets. I like the, the length's not bad. A um, little bit long, but then I do have short legs. Uh, that's what they look like from the back. And from the side. Um, I do have some shapewear on with these. The jumper is huge. I like the jumper, but I would definitely need to size down in this, so I would have to go for an extra large. I like the fact that the cuffs are ribbed, so I can pull them up my arms and they're not going to fall down. Uh, I like the colour. I quite like the colour on me as well, but it is, you can see, it is huge. I like the V-neck. It's got a little bit of ribbon around the um, V-neck. Uh, that's what it looks like from the back. I like the fact that it is long at the back um, as well as at the front and it's got that little that little split up there. I think this would look nice with a pair of jeans. Um, but it is it's it I think it's too big. What do you think? Because I would if I size down, it may be tight. Uh, and do I want to wear a baggy? I'm not sure. But that's the green jumper anyway. So let's go on to the next jumper. This next jumper is a grey cable knit jumper. Again, you can get them in an extra small to 6XL and I got it in a 2XL. It comes in 21 different colours. So if you like it, there's lots of options. It was £22 
and the material is the same as the green jumper so 55% cotton 25% modal and 20% polyester so this is the grey jumper it has a round neck but it's not a high round neck so I quite like that I like the cable knit um gives it that chunky knit feel but it it, it doesn't feel too thick uh long sleeves again um and hopefully this is long and covers the backside like a lake uh, so I'm going to try this on again with the joggers um, and we'll see what that looks like so this grey one is also quite large um, it looks weird on my shoulder there but I think that's maybe my bra strap <laughs> doing that uh, I'll just step back uh, you can see it is very long in the arms I've just I've obviously got really short arms and the cuff isn't isn't really tight so if I pull it up they may not actually stay there I do like the jumper I think the jumper is really really nice um, it feels so soft uh, again I think it's too big for us but what do you think do you think I could get away with this um, I wouldn't wear it with the joggers I would wear it with jeans uh, and I think the fact that these joggers have got this this bow in them is making everything look a bit bulkier. Does that look a little bit better? Uh, but yeah, I do like the jumper. I think the jumper is really nice and I wouldn't mind this in a couple of colours as well. I do like grey, but I do buy a lot of dark colours um, as my subscribers sometimes point out to us and I need some brighter things. Um, so I think they did, I'm sure they had it in the red and I quite like it in the red as well. But I thought I would get the, the grey just to try on. So, yeah, that was the grey jumper. So I'm just going to talk to you about the um, Fitville trainers that I got. So the first pair I got are these trainers. Now, the reason why I ordered them, I got an email from Fitville and they said, would you like to try a couple of pairs of our shoes? and um, you can show them on your channel and I thought well I had a look at the channel and the reason I decided to go for them is because they had they did them in wide and extra wide and it said they were good for chronic foot conditions now if you've watched my channel before you'll know I've got osteoarthritis in my feet and my ankles and I do have diabetic neuropathy which affects my toes so looking for comfortable shoes, finding comfortable shoes is is a difficult challenge sometimes. So I thought because they said that, I would try them. So I ordered the pair of trainers. These are rebound core shoes. Um, I got them in a the UK seven and a half. They had them in pink, purple and black. And I got these in the purple, which is featured on the back of the shoe. Uh, and I got them in the white. They do do them in an extra white as well. So these are $79 or £65, but they are so light. They are really, really light. Um, I have worn them around the house for the last day and they are very comfortable. I haven't been out in them yet um, because I just haven't been out of the house. Uh, but they, they are just so light. And because they're, they're wide, um, and they don't hurt me they don't hurt me toes um because there's plenty of room for me me toes to spread out in them and the seven and a half just gives us that little bit extra room that a seven wouldn't and an eight would be too big so i like the fact that they did half sizes uh they're nice and cushioned i think they're memory foam inside um and the laces i like the fact that there was a gap here I haven't seen that on, on other trainers or I haven't seen it on trainers that I've got or trainers that I've looked at in the shops. But what I find when I wear trainers, because I've got osteoarthritis in my feet, is this part of the shoe where the laces are hurt my feet. I feel like I just want to take the shoe off because it hurts. But the fact that there's a gap in the laces there, they don't seem to press as much on the top of my foot, but they are really, really comfortable. They do feel like they've got a little bit of a heel on them, um, but they are very cushiony to walk in, should we say. Uh, I was I was very, very pleased with them when, the, when they arrived. So those were the trainers. 
I also saw on their website these Cozy Core Boots. Um, again, I got them in the UK seven and a half. Again, these come in the wide and the extra wide and said they were good for chronic foot conditions. Um, these were $89 or about £73. Um, they do have a, a Velcro fastening. I was expecting a zip, but I don't hate the Velcro fastening. Um, they feel suede. I don't, they're not real suede. Uh, and they are furry inside. So they would keep you really warm in the winter. Again, it feels like it's got a bit of a heel on, but they are really, really light as well. Um, for, I'll put all of the, the details in the description box below if you want to go and have a, um, a better look. But I just thought these would look, you know, work really well with jeans, jeggings, um, you know, just for going going shopping or just going out in the, in the cold in the winter because my feet do get quite cold. And because these are furry inside, um, they would keep you really warm. I do think the seven and a half is a little bit bigger in the boot than in the trainer. But if you, they are boots, so you might want to wear thick socks with them. Uh, and I don't, I think that would be better because if you wear these with thin socks, it did feel a little roomy inside, but I don't have really wide feet. It's only simply for the fact that I've got osteoarthritis that I want to um, have the wider fit so I've got room to spread my toes out and they don't nip. They've got a nice sole on them as well. So I think that would grip quite well if it's like, you know, icy outside. Uh, so I do have a discount code for you if you wanted to order them. Again, I'll put the link in the description box below and I'll put the discount codes below. But uh, it's 32% discount if you've never used Fitfill before. And I know there are quite a few YouTubers have um, talked about Fitfill shoes. So you may have used them before. But if you haven't, you can get a 32% discount, which is a really good discount. Um, and the code for that is Karen32 which I'll put in the description box below. And if you have used Fitfield before, you can still get a discount of 30%, which I think is really good. Um, and the discount code for that is current 30. But again, I'll leave those in the uh, description box below if you want to go across and have a look. They do have quite a wide range. Um, so there's, the, you know, there's plenty to, to scroll through and have a look at. It took about, I'd say 10 days for these to arrive. Uh, which wasn't, you know, wasn't that much of an issue if you're, you know, you know, desperately waiting for them. So, yeah, um, I do recommend that you, you go and have a look at least to see what you think. So back to the Amazon Essential clothing. And the next thing I got was a dress. Yes, me looking for the, the, the perfect dress that I don't normally find. So this is a burgundy wrap dress, again, in extra small to 6XL, and I got it in a 2XL. It came in nine different colours. It is 95% polyester and 5% elastine, and it is £37.60, again, from the Amazon Essentials range. Now, it is a wrap dress. I've never, ever worn a wrap dress. I love the colour. I think the burgundy is a lovely colour. If you saw my um, autumn... Uh, outfit video recently I got a burgundy and cream stripe jumper I absolutely loved the color so I thought I would try this wrap dress in the burgundy as well it's a very it, polyester and elastane it's a very silky kind of feel to it um so we, I'm going to try this on and <laughs> see if uh see if I can get away with a wrap dress do you know what I really like this dress and I'm very surprised I'm just going to step back so you can see it I think it's a nice length. It's just below my knees. I think it fits us perfectly. Um, it makes us look like I've got a waist, <laughs> which I have got a waist, obviously, but it makes us look like I've got one. The the um, the tie, there's a little slit in the side where you pull the tie through inside um, and then go around the back. And then this bit has another belt tie on it and you tie them together it's also got a hidden button here as well it might be a little bit low so i may have to put a little pin in there or possibly wear a camisole underneath it but i just think i've got a mirror here i just think that is really flattering um what do you think 
haven't got any tights or anything on with it so i'd probably wear you know tights and some nice nice shoes or boots with it probably shoes if i was going somewhere nice because i think this is a, a dressy dress um but i i just really like that there, there it is from the side i think if, because it's got this gather detail it doesn't make us look that huge i'm not sure whether the material's clinging a little bit uh so you can maybe see some of my lumps and bumps but you know i have lumps and bumps so <laughs> you're gonna see them but i'm really pleased with that and i think for the price i think i said 37 pound i think that is well worth it um you know if you didn't like burgundy there is quite a lot of other colors um but yeah i don't know whether in fact I, no i don't even think if you sat down in it it's not going to gape the um the this the wrap part comes right to here and this goes right over the top i think that's great i really chuffed with that i'll probably take a photo and then think mm, i was wrong it doesn't look good but at the moment seeing it in the, uh in the camera um window i like that i think that looks good it's quite snug on the on the sleeves i have to say it is quite snug so if you've got bigger arms than me um you might have a problem you might want to size up a little bit i think this one just goes up to an xl actually did i say a 6x no it goes up to 6xl so you could um upsize in this if you wanted to so that's the burgundy dress I feel like I'm doing quite well so far because I think I've liked all of the clothes, just some of the sizes were a little bit off, but we like this dress. So the next thing I've got is another dress. Um, and this one is a, it's a blue dress. Uh, again, it comes in extra small, but it only goes up to 2XL this one. And I got it in the 2XL. Comes in eight colours. Uh, it was £26.60. 95% polyester and 5% elastine. So this is what this one looks like. It does have short sleeves, but I've also bought a cardigan because um, I thought I would wear a cardigan with it. I do get quite hot even through the winter, um, so I don't mind short sleeves. There is a little bit of a gathering on the sleeve, which I really like. I think the print is very pretty. It's like a blue with a, like a lighter blue flower on it. Um, it's got a round neck, but I would say that was more of a scoop neck. At the back, it's got like a keyhole detail with a little button. Um, it's kind of like a tea dress, I would say. So it is a, it's got a seam across here, across what would be a waist. Uh, and the skirt does flare out a little bit. And again, this, this dress feels like the, the burgundy one I've got on. It's quite silky. Uh, so we'll try that on and see if we've got as much luck with this one. I think we have another winner here. I really like this dress as well. Uh, I think it just, the shape of it just really suits my figure. I love the colour. Um, it fits really well. It's not tight around the waist. Um, I like the length of the sleeves. I love the neckline. I just really like it. Uh, so that's what it looks like from the front. You see it's got a little bit of a flare in it. Um, from the side and from the back. I would probably wear this with some thick, thick tights um, and boots or even thick tights and trainers. I think you could get away with this because it, it, it's quite a, I think this is quite a casual dress. I love the print. I think that colour is so pretty and it works well with my, my colouring. Um, yeah, I, I, I really like that. I'm very happy with that. Uh, I'm definitely going to keep this. So, yeah. So, on to the last item. And the last item is a cardigan. Uh, it is a long line cardigan with long sleeves. Um, it's cream, but they actually call it ecru. Uh, but it's cream. And it also comes in size extra small to 6XL. And again, I got it in a 2XL. It comes in 16 different colours and the material is 55% cotton, 25% modal and 20% polyester. Uh, and it's £25.30 for the cardigan. Now, it is quite a thin knit cardigan, this. Um, well, it's polyester, so it is a thin knit. But you can see it's got a long sleeve. It's got no real colour to speak of. 
Uh, it does have pockets, which we like. Um, it's got a bit of ribbon on the bottom with a little, a little split to the side. Uh, it's got no fastening, so it is a loose, it is a loose cardigan. So I'm just going to try this on with this dress. It's probably longer than the dress, uh, and we'll just see what that looks like. It's nice when you don't have to go off camera to change your clothes. You can just put it on. Actually, I quite like that. I think that's quite nice. Um, I thought it was going to be too long. But I don't know if... Maybe it would look better with jeans rather than, than the dress. Um, because it is longer than the dress. But I quite like the colour. You know, if you're wearing it with dark something dark underneath, um, it kind of brightens you up. Again, the sleeves are long, um, but they are elasticated at the cuff, uh, or ribbed at the cuff, so I can pull them up, which I would do. And I like the pockets. Uh, they are, I could do with them being a little bit higher, um, because I couldn't reach to the bottom without stretching. Uh, so yeah, they could do with being a little bit higher for me, but I am only five foot four. But yeah, I'm really, I'm really happy with that. It, it would be maybe nice if it had a couple of buttons, so if you wanted to fasten it. Um, but it doesn't, so I suppose you could always put them on. Um, but I think that's quite nice. I wasn't expecting to like it for some reason. So that's what it looks like from the front and from the side. And then the back. Yeah, I wouldn't mind this and a couple of other colours as well. Um, maybe a black or maybe a, a bright colour, uh, like pink or something. I'm quite happy with that. I would go out wearing that, I think. But again, I think with jeans rather than this dress or maybe a longer dress. Uh, I do have a black dress that it might go with. I can think of so many things it's going to go with. So... That was everything I got from Amazon Essentials. I was quite surprised how much range they had um, and the size range I thought was really good. The colour range is really good. So if you've never looked at Amazon Essentials before, it's well worth having a look and you can use Prime Try before you buy. So you can get up to six items. You get seven days from when they arrive to try them on um, without paying. Then once you've decided which ones you want to keep, you just send the rest back and you pay for what you've kept. Uh, which I think is a really useful um, feature that Amazon have got. And also don't forget to go across and look at the, the Fitville um, shoes and trainers and boots that uh, they have on their website. And again, I'll put the discount codes below for you. So that's all I've got for you today. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, again, like I say, it's really cold outside, so I hope you're all warm and snuggly inside. Uh, let us know what your favourite piece is. Um, I always like to hear your comments. So thanks so much for watching. I'll be back on Sunday with the Sunday Sunshine Show and we are talking about coats. So another another clothing um, video. So come back for that at half seven on Sunday morning. And that is in collaboration with the Transatlantic Housewives of YouTube, who are myself, uh, Marie from Busy Bee Marie, Maria from Maria Crocker and Tina from Tina's Talk Time. So like I said, thanks so much for watching. Uh, I'll see you soon and bye for now.